Hello friends, welcome in the world of Maths by Amiye. In this learning concept video, we revise two basic concepts and use those concepts in our question. The question is in front of you in a trapezium ABCD, AB is parallel to CD, AB is 280 cm and CD is 180 cm. Angle A and B are 65 and 25 degrees respectively. Point P and Q are midpoints of side AB and CD in same order then find distance between P and Q. Before solving this question, first revise the concept. We are going to revise two concepts. If ABC is a triangle and DE, line DE parallel to BC. If we draw a line from A passing through DE touches B, say this point is P, this point is Q. The ratio of DP to PE, if M is to N, I am saying this is the ratio, then the ratio of BQ to QC is also M is to N. That is the concept of basic proportionality theorem. If we have a triangle and the two lines are the parallel, if we draw a line from the vertex passing through DE and BC, if this line divides DE in two parts M is to N, then this line divides BC again in two parts M is to N in the same ratio. This is our first concept. Second, if PQR is a right angle triangle and say X is the midpoint of PR, then we can say QX is the median and this point is nothing but the circumcenter of the circle and PX is equal to XR is equal to QX. If we have midpoint on the hypotenuse of a right angle triangle then QX that is the median is equal to half of the hypotenuse and the PX is equal to XR is equal to XQ. I hope both two concepts are clear. One is of the parallel lines concept, one is of the right angle triangle and the midpoint of the hypotenuse. Now use these con two concepts in our Question. I have drawn a figure according to question. ABCD is a trapezium. AB is 280 cm. CD is 180 cm. Angle A is 65. Angle B is 25. Can we say 65 plus 25 is nothing but 90? So, if we extend the line AD and BC, we are making a right angle triangle somewhere above the line DC. Let's draw the figure. So, this is our construction. I extended AD till O, BC till O. Since this is a 65 and 25, we can say we are getting a right angle triangle at O. P and Q are the midpoints. Can we say ODC is a right angle triangle and OAB is also a right angle triangle. And OQ and OP is nothing but a straight line because this ratio is 1 is to 1 and this ratio is 1 is to 1. Since both two ratios are the same, from the common point, we can draw a straight line. That is the concept number 1. Now apply the concept number 2. Since this is the midpoint, so we can say the DQ is nothing but 90 and QC is nothing but a 90 half of 180 and OQ we can say OQ is again also the 90 that is the median right angle triangle hypotenuse midpoint again in triangle OAB AB is hypotenuse and the P is the midpoint so we can say AP is nothing but 140 PB is nothing but 140 half of 280 and OP OP again is nothing but 140 that is the median equal to the circumradius and PQ is nothing but OP minus OQ, that is OP minus OQ, 140 minus 90 is 50 our required answer. So this question is based on a two basic concept. You just need to understand 65 and 25 is nothing but 9. So we are working on an extended right angle triangle and the midpoint concept. I hope it is clear. The aim behind this learning concept is to let you know the most important thing for the solving any question is to know the basic concept and recall the basic concept at the right time. I hope it is clear to you. Even if you have any doubt, feel free to ping me. Thank you and happy learning.